but I can use the limited amount of power that I have to, to find that lost love, or for a reasonable fee, I can be that lost love. <laughs>
the church sex scandal all sound like bad porno movies. Mm -hmm. And I've been, wait, wait a minute, I collected a bunch of these headlines. You collect wanna... headlines? Yeah, well, just the these. church sex scandal. Of the church, don't these all sound like, like porno movies? Listen to this. Gay priests feel the heat. <laughs> yeah. We got a red, that looks good. Uh, this other one, sex and brimstone. <laughs> Tonight on Showtime, <laughs> Sex and Brent with Eric Roberts. And, <laughs> and then, um, oh, hey, or Eric Roberts. He was good in Sex and Brent. Though. <laughs> yeah. I, I believed it. Yeah. Um, and then this one sounds like a Lifetime movie. Torn Innocence. <laughs> I know. Linda Lavin and Tom Selleck. <laughs> Linda in Lavin is not in Torn Innocence. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then this is the one, this is the director that's in porn but thinks he's going to get out of porn someday, like has pretensions. He has aspirations. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, this is Shadow of the Cross, The Molested. <laughs> and then all this, we got to give it like a big title. <laughs> There's like some producer, just we're shooting it over the weekend, just get it done. I, what are you, Coppola? What's wrong with you? Now, what's going on with you personally in your life? Oh, are things okay? Things are, I, these last four months have been a little shaky. Uh, I had a very... Starting in January, uh, this happened in January, I started getting these collect calls from somebody named Palo. I would get these calls, the, the, uh, it was a recorded thing where it would go, you have a collect call from, and then he would record his voice, and it was like, Palo, like, hey, <laughs> Palo's calling. Pick, like, he sounded really happy and right. excited, like right. someone's going to pick up. And, right, right. And I'm never home, so I was never there to accept the call. So as the months so you're went by, you're just listening to them on your answering machine. I would machine. listen to the to the messages, and uh, and as the months went by, he got more despairing. Like they would, it would, I would, I would pick up my messages and would go, "You have a collect call from," and the voice would be like, "Hello." Like, <laughs> why is there people there? Like, right, like right. His, and my heart was just breaking for this guy. Like, I just so wanted to help him. Like, you know, maybe someone gave him bad information, or something. So finally. I, I'm there one afternoon, and the phone rings, and I pick it up, and the, the voice goes, you have a collect call. And if they, if you could have done a Chinese Zoom on me like that, oh, Velo, yes! Like, I was, I'm here for you, buddy! So I hit one to accept it, and then I'm like, hi, hey, Palo, look, you've been calling the, the wrong guy. And then he just goes, oh, yes, uh, no, no, I, I'm like, no, no, Palo, please don't hang up, I can help you find, and then he hung up on me. And I was like, no! Like, if, just like now pulling away from me as I'm screaming at that, ah! <laughs> so, Palo, the minute he heard it's a wrong number, he was like, oh, sorry. He, no, no, no. And he just hung up on me. And so, I, you know, I'm actually kind of glad that I'm on this show now because I would like to... Can I just make a little appeal? Sure. To, do you mind? Just a little on-air appeal? Know. Could you Could you play, play something kind of mournful and wistful for me, Max? Just a little... Guys, do... Oh, okay, there we go. All right, let me... Which camera's on me? Is that, that one? Okay, cool. Um, <laughs> Halo, <laughs> I don't know who or what you were looking for. Perhaps a distant relative or maybe a lost love. But I know I can help because I'm in show business. I'm what Access Hollywood would call a quasi-celebrity. <laughs> I don't have a lot of power, not the power of a Conan O'Brien who, with a single phone call, can scramble the sixth fleet or fix a parking ticket or bring a smile to a baby's face. <laughs> but I can use the limited amount of power that I have to, to find that lost love or for a reasonable fee, I can be that lost love. <laughs> Our thanks to you, the King of Queens. Monday nights at 8 on CBS. We'll be right back with Sarah Bowles. Stick around.